Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Priscilla. So in this video, we're going to be continuing with the uh, lab setup for our SCCM installation. And what we're going to do specifically in this video is install Active Directory and then create our own domain. So it's gonna be really cool. Um, I hope you guys like it. Uh, all right, let's get to it. All right, so we're in our domain server. We're gonna to go to manage, add roles and features, go to next, next, and next on this one, we're gonna select Active Directory domain services, add features, and we're gonna go ahead and click next. We're going to click next, next, and then we're gonna check that box right there yes and then install it i'm going to speed up through this section and then we're going to click promote the server to a domain controller so this is going to be our domain controller I'm going to click add new forest and then we're going to pick a name you can pick whatever name you want for yours for mine i'm going to pick Cleon.com. It sounds like an alien. <laughs> Click next. And gonna wait for that. We're going to wait for that to load. Um, let's see. What are we doing on this page? Uh, we're gonna click a pass, select the password for this. Um, leave that. Click next on this one. Oh, what is this? Okay, just click next, and then we're going to wait for that to load. Um, do, 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 do. Just gonna wait for it to load. Okay, Pleon it is. And then we're going to, that's gonna be our NetBIOS domain name. So that looks all good and we're going to click next and wait for that to load as well. Going to leave that as is and we're gonna just go ahead and click next on this page. And next here as well. So we don't have to do anything here. Um, it's gonna check the prerequisites to make sure that we have everything in place before we can install Active Directory. We're just gonna wait for that to load. And okay, it has some stuff there, but that's fine. It'll still let us install. Install it. I'm gonna speed up through this because it real time it was kind of slow. <laughs> so I won't make you guys go through that. All right. And okay, so that's done. I'm going to go ahead and uh, log in here. So now it's, you can see it's Pleon slash administrator. So this is our domain. So we got that. Okay. All right. So now we're going to go to our SECM server because we're going to add this one to our domain. We're gonna to go to local server. We're going to go to, where are we? No, not there. We're gonna to go to their computer name, change, and then we're gonna select member of domain and we're going to enter our new domain, which is pleon.com. I'm gonna go ahead and put okay. And then we'll enter the password that we created. So it's gonna be administrator. And then the password we created, we set it up and put it okay. So there you go, welcome to plan.com domain. So we're joined and then we gotta restart to establish it. And so we're gonna go ahead and close it. Um, sorry, I'm looking at something. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and close it. We're gonna do restart now. We're gonna go ahead and let that restart. So next we're going to go to our DHCP server because we're gonna add that to the domain as well. So we're gonna go DHCP server, local server, our computer name, change, and then domain. And it'll be pleon.com, enter administrator, and then the password we created. 
Are you your you created when you do this? Okay, we're gonna go and restart it. Uh-huh, there you go. Welcome to Pleon.com. Cool. Restart, close, restart now. That's gonna load up. All right, so now we're going to actually log into our domain. So we're going to do other. We're gonna do Pleon slash administrator because it's actually like our domain that we created. So it's pretty cool. Um, and then we're going to enter the password that we created for that one and uh, log in. So we're in now. And then also on our DHCP server, we're going to do the same thing. We're going to go to other user and then we're going to go enter, uh, sorry, <laughs> other user. And then we're going to put Pleon slash administrator and enter our password for that one. And cool, it worked. All right. So yeah, we um, were able to install Active Directory and then we created our domain and now we have added all of our um, other machines onto the domain controller. So we're all joined, we got our IP settings ready. And um, the next thing that we're going to do is, in our next video, we're gonna configure DNS reverse lookup um, to continue on with our SCCM, like getting it ready to install SCCM. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys have any comments, any suggestions, feel free to let me know. You know, if you want to go ahead and subscribe, you can go ahead and do that. I'm going to be posting more videos to continue this series. Um, like, hit the like button if you liked it. Um, uh, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks so much. Thanks so much for watching. Have a good one. Bye.